Sunshine Coast residents are being urged to get ahead of the pack and prepare themselves for the arrival of the University Hospital. The Business Council believes flow-on effects will ripple through almost every sector. It's the development which has been touted as a game changer for the coast. Lifting the equivalent of the Royal Brisbane and Women's Hospital and putting it in the midst of, uh, of, of, of the Sunshine Coast. With 450 beds increasing to almost 800 by 2021, the Business Council is urging locals to get in and get trained now. Roughly speaking, uh, you know, we've, we're going to really need to be doubling our workforce in, in, a, in a nearly a decade or so. But the opportunities won't be limited to the health sector. Council is currently holding information forums for construction workers, spelling out how they too can cash in. This really is a wonderful opportunity and one that Sunshine Coast businesses can't afford to miss out on. While the net has been cast to employ the region's professionals, the health service says securing interstate and international practitioners will be crucial to filling jobs. We certainly have high quality professionals here already, but the numbers that we're talking about can't be met from locals alone. The state government is also vowing to throw its support behind the project. The health minister recently announcing hospital boards can now choose to buy all products locally. It can be things like rubber gloves, it can be all the services, uh, the, the consumables that go into a health system. Alexia Osborne, Win News.